everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you enjoy my Captain Cook Oven Plus review and make sure you stick around for the end of the video. I will be showing you how to do a quick and easy setup and how to make pizza, so. Hey everyone, my name is Dre. You already knew that. And today I'm camping out in Angeles National Forest. And I'm so excited because today's sponsor is the Oven Plus Salamander Grill from Captain Cook. And you guys, this thing is next level. I'm gonna show you how to use it, give you my review. Even though this thing is sick as hell, I don't really have anything bad to say. I'm just gonna cook up some really nice food for you and show you how easy it is to have some like amazing gourmet meal while out camping. Gone are the days of like basic necessities. You can have some amazing like lobster meal. I'm talking legit restaurant grade right here in the middle of the forest. All you need is a propane tank. Literally, psh, that's it. I'm gonna show you how, so let's get started. Super easy to turn the thing on. In the manual, it says that you might have to do it a couple tries. Make sure when you turn on the gas that you leave the cover open. You can clearly see it's lit. I didn't need a lighter, I didn't need nothing. So super dope, I don't know, I think that's really cool. So now while this is heating up real quick, I'm gonna show you guys how I use a pan, just a regular cast iron pan. And then we're gonna make some amazing steak and chicken. The little Baba's gonna get some too. So I brought some onions and garlic to go with the steak. Always gotta have hot dogs, some beef steak tomatoes, free range chicken some steak. Super yummy. Butter. <laughs> you know, the world would be a lot happier if they just ate more butter. <laughs> now you wanna make sure that you have this thing on high for now while it's heating up. I want it to be about 550 degrees. Just go ahead and start adding your seasonings. Garlic powder, garlic salt, and onion powder. These are the only things, the only seasonings you need. If you're out camping, you're on a budget, this right here is all you need to cook up some tasty meat. It's just the basics. I also brought some pepper and some basil leaves for the chicken. And I'm using avocado oil because it can withstand a higher heat. about most with the Captain Cook Oven Plus Salamander Grill. It's a really long name, but this thing is so cool. It, I knew that this was going to allow some new horizons for me because I am an outdoorsy girl, but I really do like the simplicity and the ease of things. If I want to go camping, I just want it to be super easy, like everything to be a breeze. I know it, it's not supposed to be, but at the end of the day, things like this really do make it so much easier. Like this is all you literally need, plus a propane tank and you're ready to go and you can start making some sick meals. Like, look at this. We're about to eat so good right now. I'll season up the chicken. Same seasonings, I'm telling you. Any meat, it really doesn't matter. Salmon, fish. And avocado. Of course, pepper. All right, now let's check if the oven is hot enough. We are at 400 degrees, so I think we're ready. I think we can get started. Let's go ahead and put the steak in. I know this thing is so cool because the top and the bottom, it allows you to cook several things at the same time. Put this bad boy in there. And then I'm gonna put the onions in. <laughs> that is just so sick. Ah, I love it. And while that's in the oven, make sure you guys follow them on Instagram at Oven Plus Salamander Grill. If you're interested, hit that link and shop it up because this thing is super cool. It's only like 400, it's under $400. So, I mean, it's super affordable and it has a long life. Like this thing has honestly gone through a beating. I've had it for over a year, believe it or not. This thing actually generates little to no smoke. So that is amazing. Now with the steak, I just kind of like to turn it a little bit. Just a little bit. 40 degree angle. And then another two and a half minutes. All right. These bad boys are doing real good in here. There's definitely a fun factor to this where it's like, you don't have to have that like basic 
anything anymore. You can have like really cool, awesome lifestyle out here in the middle of nowhere. And this really opens up the gates to low key, like living in your van. Hey, <laughs> this thing is lit. Like if you like to travel a lot, you live in your car, you're a trucker. I highly recommend this thing because it's so portable. Like it fits in my tiny car, my sedan. I can lift this. I personally, little me, 120 pound me, I can, I can lift this thing pretty easily. Oh, it's also important to note that the longer you have this part up, it uh, a lot of the heat actually leaves. So, looks like the steak is ready. I went ahead and just threw some hot dogs on there. Super easy. Ooh. Look at that. Gorgeous. Perfectly made. Look at those luscious grill marks. Oh, look at that. That's just a beauty. And yes, I washed this, so leave me alone. Let's give that a try. But first, let's put our chicken in. One of the easiest things you can ever cook up on a grill. Actually, I'm gonna put this little one over here. Put this big one towards the back. Oh my gosh. It's even better than last time, because I know what I'm doing now. Mm. Oh my god. That is a perfectly made steak. Literally, you need to try this. Everything's done. That was so extremely easy and everything came out like, I just went to two canos and spent like 90 bucks. Just go ahead and turn that bad boy off. It was that easy. Look at these gorgeous chickens. Oh my lordy. Lordy, Lord, Lord. I don't know, I think this thing is just so cool. I don't have any complaints about it. The size, the weight, how it works, how easy it is. It's so user-friendly. Like if you're like me and, you're, and you need like people to hold your hand for stuff like this, this is the machine for you. So that is freaking beautiful. I've never used a grill before. This is like legit. This is my second time using a grill, so I'm actually so shook. This thing is a 10 out of 10 for me. I hope you guys enjoyed my Oven Plus review. I'm gonna continue enjoying this thing and I hope you do too. So if you decide to, make sure to use that link in the description. Summer is here, so now is the time to get this thing. It's camping season, let's go. Like, I'm ready to hop in the Jeep and just, bye. I'm so excited about this Oven Plus Double Deck Outdoor Pizza Oven because it is so innovative. It is actually the world's first double deck outdoor pizza oven. So you can make all styles of pizza and it comes with a free propane gas regulator and built-in gas ignition. So you don't even need a lighter. Super easy to turn on. The Captain Cook Oven Plus is ideal for outdoor use. It has a thermal convection design with a patented butterfly burner, so it gets up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit within 10 minutes. Very impressive. And the upper stone can reach up to 900 degrees Fahrenheit, so you don't have to worry about it breaking if it gets too hot. Just make sure that you watch that temperature. Setup is super easy. Make sure that you don't pick it up by this piece. I actually did that and as you can see it kind of bent, but it easily bent back into straight place. But just make sure that you pick it up from the sides only and not from the front and the back. And then you just go ahead and put in the metal slabs. Put in the first fat catcher and then the second. And then a third one comes in. And then the grill itself just plops right on there, super easy. With the pizza stone on the top, ta-da, and you are ready to start cooking. It may take a couple tries to turn it on. It also comes with a free pizza spatula and a pizza cutter, and they're actually really nice quality. It's super easy to make amazing meat, fish, lobster, anywhere and everywhere. It is virtually smoke free, free shipping in the US only and free returns as well. So it is 100% risk free. And it also comes with a two year warranty, which is awesome. 
I love how portable this thing is. I can take it with me anywhere and it fits in my small sedan. From the bottom, the flame is above, so it heats up the top of the meat. It's not like a normal grill where it's underneath. So just keep that in mind. It doesn't really change much, I've noticed, and it still cooks really amazing. The results were amazing. Some of the most tender meat I've tried in a long time. I seriously regret not grilling sooner. Like this, this is the best way to make meat in my opinion. Oh my God, it's so good. Mm. Honestly, I'm shook right now. Oh my God. Now for the pizza, go ahead and learn from my mistakes because I went ahead and put the pizza on the top first and then the bottom. But you're actually going to want to put it the opposite. You're going to want to put it on the bottom grill first to crisp up the top and then put it on the top pizza rack after to crisp up the crust and voila, you will have perfect pizza. Super happy with the results. I hope you guys try it out. Thank you so much to Captain Cook for giving me this grill because it is spectacular and I am so happy with it. Check it out, link in the description. See you guys later, bye. Oh my God, it's so good.